my mom was always like, I am doing this so that you don't have to, so that you can go get educated and you can have a voice and you can fight and you can, you know, uh, uh, pursue your, your dreams. I remember getting my first job at Goldman Sachs, which you know at the time was 0405, and it was it is still one of the top financial services firms in the world. And my mom was like, she thought I worked at Saks Fifth Avenue. That's what she told her friends. <laughs> <That's so cute. laughs> and you know, and and uh, but there again, it's like as long as you're happy, do you have health insurance? Yeah, okay, that's it, right? And so that's how they they thought about it. When I left Goldman Sachs to to start at a venture fund here in Chicago. Uh, my dad's like, why would you leave a, a good paying job with good health insurance? And I kind of had to explain what I was doing. And he's like, oh, okay, you know, kind of, it, it was obviously worried, but if it makes you happy, go for it. And, you know, even now they, they, they still kind of know, they don't know what, what I do, right? My, dad, my dad's like, oh, one of my friends, you know, he sells tacos out of his truck. You know, is this something you can invest, you know, or you could give him money and he said, give him money. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, you know, let's, let's talk to these different options. I didn't know what a VC was for a long time. Can you explain that real quick? Yeah, so basically it's someone that raises money from either high net worth individuals or um, institutions on a thesis, on a, a thesis, a strategy of what to invest in, what companies to invest in. And then they take that money and then invest it into high growth mm -hmm. companies. So it might not be the, the taco truck, as, as mm -hmm. my, you know, I alluded to earlier, but it's who can be the next Uber, who can be the next Airbnb. You're so rare uh, as a Latina and as a venture capitalist. Do you feel pressure to do more? It feels like a lot of pressure, absolutely. You know, because there's people that think that you're not gonna succeed. You're, I don't look like, if you Google venture capitalists, you know, it, it doesn't look like me. <laughs> I, you know, Latina, short, everything is not um, what it looks like to be a successful venture capitalist. I have been given an opportunity and I've worked, you know, very hard for it and I feel a lot of pressure because also the businesses I'm investing in are not the traditional VC investments. So they don't necessarily have, you know, the Ivy League education. They don't come from Silicon Valley. There are many times women and minorities, not always, but many times. They don't necessarily have a network. They don't have the language. And so everybody passes on them or doesn't even respond or look at them. And so I'm trying to find these unicorns in these areas that nobody else is looking. And many times I'm investing when other people are not. I am trying to prove that you can have an outsized diverse portfolio and get outsized returns. And that's a very, a very, very different thing than how funds have historically invested and how they've made money. 